Ladies and gentlemen, the playing of our national anthem. The graduation ceremony began as usual at 2 p.m. with Principal Corey Marshall speaking from a podium in Purdue's Elliott Hall of Music. But the ceremony was pre-recorded because of the coronavirus, and Harrison High School's 440 seniors, their family members, and friends had to watch online. This past two months, things have not gone the way we all expected. But that did not stop our teachers from continuing to push us. The eight valedictorians had to record their speeches, which for the most part contained traditional messages. This is my challenge to you and myself going into the future, that we will treat and love other people the way that we want to be treated and loved, and that we would not be content and not striving to become better people. Whether we were terrified most of the way or screaming and laughing with joy, this roller coaster ride has made us all into the people we are now and the generation that will go out and do amazing things for the world. A fast moving video started off the graduation ceremony for McCutcheon's 380 seniors, followed by the class president and the choir. I was here. McCutcheon's 17 valedictorians also recorded their speeches. The many amazing teachers I've gotten to have have left a greater impact on me than I think they realize. I've also been able to meet some really special friends at McCutcheon. Four years ago, when I made the decision to go for valedictorian, I never thought it would be like this, but I'm grateful that we're making do with what we've got during these interesting times. I cannot thank enough all the teachers that put in the extra effort to not only teach their class, but also how to be good, successful people. You brought spirit. In the end, members of both graduating classes say their high school careers and COVID-19 have prepared them for the future. For Star City News, I'm Chris Morris-Ivica in Tippecanoe County.